Let me give you some background on Lori David. On her website, which is stopglobalwarming.org, misuse of, of energy and power is creating the uh, Earth's surface to heat up. I will uh, let Lori explain to us in, in further detail. You know, I was going to ask you, what is the number one contributor of global warming? Well, I'm assuming it's, it's oil consumption, right? Well, it's power plants and cars. You know, this next generation of car buyers are going to have to be the first generation that demands fuel-efficient cars. They're going to have to be that. Now, there's a choice. They could buy a hybrid car and get 45 miles to a gallon, or they can buy, you know, a gas-guzzling SUV where they get to ride up high that gets 15 miles to the gallon. What effects does the car uh, have that makes global warming occur? Well, here's what happens. When you go to sleep at night and you're cold, you throw on a bunch of blankets, right? And then in the middle of the night, at some point, you're going to get too hot. And so what do you do? You start kicking them off, you cool down, and you have a beautiful night's sleep. Well, this is exactly what is happening to the planet, except that the planet can't kick the blankets off. The CO2 goes into the atmosphere, it surrounds the planet equally, and it's like a bunch of warm woolen blankets surrounding the Earth. And the problem so it's is... it's not escaping. It's keeping the heat in. It's keeping the planet warm, and there's no way of kicking the blankets off. And that's the problem. And when CO2 goes into the atmosphere, it hangs around for about 100 years or more. That's the issue. And it's holding in the, in the heat. And the heat is heating up the waters and heating up the planet.